Hey, I'm Rick McBride with uh, McBride Realty Group, your property masters. This is Tom Ward. Hello, everybody. <laughs> Tom and I met a long time ago in a Leeds group, and um, we've kind of hung together. I throw stuff his way, he throws stuff my way. And uh, basically, Tom had uh, was buying a house, right? Yeah, yeah, I'll tell you. So we bought a house. We loved it. We'd been watching the market for a while. We'd talked to Rick like a year ago. He gave us some suggestions. Right. And uh, we, we found the house in this crazy market that we felt like was a great That's deal. That's crazy in itself, right? And, uh, and so we were urgent to get it. So we offered a 30-day, no contingency offer, and they accepted. Kind of scary, right? Well, yeah. I mean, basically at that point, you got to make things happen. And right. for us, we felt like we were getting a good enough deal and it was the house we wanted right. that it was worth taking a hit. And so we were just going to sell to Open Door, the online. Okay. So for those of you who don't know, Open Door is one of those companies. There's many companies and they basically are nationwide flippers. So they buy a property, they do very little to it. They paint it, they throw some carpet down. His house needed next to nothing. Um, they, they throw some carpet down, put some paint up, and boom, they put it back on the market for 50,000 more. And uh, there's nothing necessarily wrong with that, but that's their model. So Tom was uh, smart enough, but we have such a, a good enough relationship. Before he signed with them, he called and said, hey Rick, let's just talk about this for a second. Here's what we're thinking about doing. And so my first question for you is, why did you originally consider um, selling to Open Door. So the appeal of Open Door, given our situation, we'd already were kind of shopping our prices. We just wanted right. to know ballpark what we were sure. looking at. We knew we were making a decent profit. And uh, the appeal was we're able to move out when we wanted to. Right. And we weren't going to have to haggle or fix anything. Right. And so, you know, knowing we only had 30 days from that day forward, we, we knew we were on a time crunch and we knew that, you know, most of the time when you sell or list something, uh, you know, that's all you've got is right. that kind of time. Sure. And, uh, and so that was the whole reason we, we were willing, we wanted the new house enough. We were willing to compromise okay. and take the loss. So why did you decide not to list with them? So I decided not to list with them. Uh, I just the market or not to sell to them. Yeah, the, the market being what it was, I knew that everyone was looking and I had been friends with Rick for a few years now. And I think I just shot him a text and I was like, do you have anybody in the market for our house? Right. And he was familiar with our house. So we felt comfortable about that. And, uh, and I said, you know, we're looking to do it with open door. This is the price. And his immediate text back was like, no, like 16 O's. And, uh, and so we, we, we talked and he was like, look, I get you're on a tight crunch. The market's hot. He's like, he, he just said, give me a week, give me one week and, and we can make it happen. And literally they went into like overload and I think you guys had us listed like 48 hours, 36 hours, like Probably from that point quick, forward yeah. Yeah. and uh, pictures and everything. And away we went just like that. Yep. So how much did open door offer you for your property? So open door offered us two fourteen nine, and uh, mm -hmm. that, that for us, we knew we were leaving probably at least 25 or 30,000 on the table. Um, just with what the market was and we had actually haggled them up to 219 because we said, ah, we're going to list with somebody else. And they're like, we can go a little more for you. And, uh, and that's where we stood at that now, point. Was that, was that what you were going to put in your pocket or were there other fees as well? No, no, no. So there were other fees. They were 7% on their fees, uh, and everything else we ended up, we were going to walk with. The 219 was the offer. We were going to walk with 194. Okay. And uh, so 194 was your net. Right. Okay. So how much did we sell your house for? 247. Listed it at 240, and we had that offer. What three days from the time we listed it, we had, we had that offer 7,000 above asking. Yeah. So 7,000 above asking. 247 and one. What was your? One, 194 was going to be our net. So. Fifty-three thousand dollars less. Huge difference. 
So, so if you had sold to Open Door, and, 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 and we completely understand you and everyone else's um, attraction in them, you think, hey, we're getting enough and we don't have to have any hassle. Was there any hassle? I mean, one weekend, right? So literally, it was one weekend of an open house. We had a contract the following Monday. I think we had listed on a Wednesday. Literally, it was just that fast. And we had said going in, look, we know it's an old house. We've fixed up a lot of stuff, but we don't want a bunch of contingencies. We don't want to have to go fix a bunch of things and take care of a bunch of problems, which Open Door was giving us that opportunity. And, uh, and Rick was like, hey, it's no problem. Let's take care of it. And you did. So we didn't have to fix anything, which was fantastic. And uh, you guys made that happen for us. All right. So for someone considering Open Door, Yes. Uh, and considering selling with open door um, what would you tell them right now if i said to you i said okay tom i said i just don't want to deal with any showings i don't want to deal with anything i just want to be done with it so for my friends or family anybody alike first off i recommend a good agency with people that are going to shoot you straight these guys have been fantastic rick and sarah it's who i've dealt with but beyond that if you're considering open door in this red hot market, you are leaving money on the table because at this point your house will sell fast. It will sell easily. And, and literally it's just as simple as selling it to open door. I mean, open door sent people over, they do a walkthrough. You already cleaned up for those people to come walk your property. Right. You can just as easily give these guys. I mean, even if you're on a time crunch, Give them a week, give them two weeks, you'll be pleasantly surprised. So one thing, if I speak for Tom a little bit, he said, you know, he made a good enough profit, we were happy with our profit, and while that is in fact true, he still was gonna make a pretty good profit. He was leaving $50,000 on the table. He was putting essentially $50,000 into their pocket instead of putting it into his pocket. Call us, we will put it into your pocket. Don't leave any money on the table let us get you top dollar so tom um at this point thank you for coming out tom actually you're still doing drawings and everything right yeah i'm a draftsman locally i draw house plans home design if you need any any help you can look me up but uh yeah great experience uh i fully recommend you guys to everybody i know so thank you for your help we got more money in our pocket. We're taking a trip to England in June. Yeah. Easily paying for that trip. That's you're going, right. You're staying in the, in the penthouse yeah. now. Yeah, we've upgraded. <laughs> we get the castle suite now. <laughs> Tom, thank you very much. Appreciate it. Thank it was you. great. Appreciate it. Mm -hmm.